can hear the distinct roar of the traffic. It must have been pretty odd during the 2020 lockdown when no cars were on the road. It had been like reverting to the landscape before the building of the uh, M25 across it. Because it's certainly busy enough on a, on a Monday evening. And up ahead is the only footbridge across the motorway for a few miles in either direction. So I can see there's a, a way through beside the gate, which is kind of useful. A little country style. That's one of those mysterious junctions that uh, you don't know about. They're not marked as junctions uh, for cars. We sometimes see an emergency maintenance vehicle bombing up them. And they're like a secret, although it does say no vehicles except motorized vehicles, but like a secret way to get off the motorway. I didn't tell you that, did I? No, it's all not. Bloody hell, this is noisy. And for completeness, the other direction. There's a tunnel up ahead. But with any luck, we'll be able to leave the noise of this behind pretty quickly. Because it's, uh, it's not a pleasant environment. There's the, uh, the other way off the motorway. It's unlike other ones where you can um, get, get off into the UK road system. But what this one is, is just to cross the motorway in an emergency and get off and on again. I assume it's uh, all CCTV cameras now. And that's uh, befitting the M25, I see some wonderful fly tipping ahead. It sort of adds to the uh, the environment. Lovely bit of fly tipping. Hopefully there's uh, some baked bean cans and worms in... Oh, I don't know. Don't really want to think about it. All I want to do is navigate through it without putting my foot in a... in something. Looks like someone's come up the motorway, fly tipped, and gone back onto the motorway. It's like I'm under this at flytipping.com where you can uh, figure out where the best fly tipping zones are. No public access, private land. Oh yeah, that's not that's not our bit. That is how obscure. Public footpath goes this way. Suits me. Some lovely horses. 